We're in New York, just did my first sail on the, the Land Rover BAR boat. One of the most incredible things I've, I've witnessed firsthand, just seeing how well coordinated those guys are and the talk between them, I, I was blown away. It's the Louis Vuitton America's Cup race. I was on the boat, yeah, I was, didn't quite grasp what an amazing thing it is to do and how much of an honour it is. And um, I'm just kind of still, still sinking in, really. It's kind of surreal that I'm here and I'm with these amazing sportsmen. <laughs> I think this particular America's Cup is perhaps one of the toughest ever and of course we have an incredibly strong defender in Oracle Team USA, uh, Jimmy Spithall and, and the team there. We know they're going to be very, very tough to beat. It's incredible to, to watch them work. I, I don't know how they manage to coordinate with each other so well. Or... It's, it's incredible. You get to see how the boat works, how to operate it. I haven't got the first clue how to do any of that. From someone who doesn't know anything about sailing, it's, it's you know, it feels like another world. When we're out there racing, it's about winning. I'm not really interested in anything else. So, yeah, we give it everything we've got. We want to win, we want to be successful. That's what our team is about. After seeing this firsthand, I, I have so much more respect for what they do. As sportsmen, as worldwide known sportsmen, they're pretty humble, so it's, um, it was a great experience. I loved it. Yeah, huge respect for those guys. We start to impress for Independence Day at the end of this month. It's a follow-on from the, the original story of Independence Day, 20 years later, and uh, we pick up and sort of see where Earth is with everything and how they've rebuilt themselves, and um, they come back. It's been a torrid time for, for Theon Greyjoy slash Reek. Um, you're going to see more Greyjoy action, without a doubt. And I think there's definitely a sort of running theme of strong female characters this year. And I've been itching to get back on stage for years. Um, and so I'm doing this play called The Spoils with Jesse Eisenberg. It's great, so I'm doing that. And then there's something else which I can't really talk about, but it's got an amazing cast and it's a big movie. So then back to the, well, I'm not going to say, I'm not going to give anything away. <laughs>